Devon Larat versus Levan Saginashvili. This time, Larat has more chances to win than two years ago because it's the first match after Levan's injury and Larat is stronger and has improved in his technique. Larat knows how to move better and he will pull another way. I think Levan is the favorite 60%. If Devon wins, I will sing a song for him. Hermes Gasparini versus Alijan Muratov. Alijan was very strong with his left arm when we pulled. I think now he can be the world champion in the super heavyweight category. I think he can beat Morozov and Lalatin. Maybe Ivan Matyushenko would be a good fight for him. I also think that Hermes will beat Alijan because Hermes has a very strong left arm. Alex Kurdesha versus Georgi Tsvetkov. It's a very interesting fight. Kurdecha now has more experience, and he has improved. Kurdecha now feels better than two years ago. Alex is a very difficult opponent for Georgi. I think it's a 50-50 match, but I hope that Kurdecha will win because he is my friend. Michael Todd versus Frank Lamparelli. Lamparelli will have better wrist control and hand, but I think he will not be able to finish Michael. I think Michael is going to win. Schoolboy versus Leonidas Arcona. I have never pulled with Schoolboy and I have pulled with Leonidas. I think Schoolboy has more chances to win. Mindaugas Tarasaitis versus Arthur Makarov. Mindaugas is a very technical and smart guy. Makarov is very strong and it's very difficult to use your technique. I think Mindaugas has more chances to win. Fia Rysek versus Ekaterina Nikisheva. I think Fia Rysek wins. Irakli Zirakashvili versus Sasho Andreev. It's a very interesting match. Sasho beat John three months ago. Sasho has a good technique to block the pronation. You need good endurance to beat Sasho. Last time when Irakli and Sasho pulled, Sasho won. But now Irakli has changed and has more chances to win than last time. It's possible that Irakli can win quick. Overall, I think Sasho has more chances to win because there are many rounds in the match and Sasho has very good endurance. Petro Marharint versus Nugzari Chikadze. Nugo is very strong in hook and has a good start and endurance. Petro's wrist is very strong. I have not seen a guy who opened his wrist ever. I remember his match against Rivaz in Moldova and it was a big surprise. Nugo has a chance to beat Petro, but I don't know what will happen. It's a very interesting match. I would say it's a 50-50 match. Sandris Sidis versus Ibrahim Sagov. Sandris has a good top roll, but he doesn't have good side pressure. Sagov can pull like Camille with his press. I think Sagov will win. Talgat Aktaev versus Betkili Onyani. Talgat beat Oleg Zhoch and Betkili lost to Oleg. Now Betkili and Talgat will go inside. I think Talgat has more chances to win. Brandon Elsesser versus Stoyan Golemanov. Golemanov's right arm is strong with a good top roll. I pulled with him one time in Sofia in 2015 and I beat him. I don't know much about Brandon. Kamil Jablonski versus Tobias Sporong. I think in first round, Tobias will open Kamil's wrist and Kamil will go in press and win. If Tobias opens Camille's wrist and uses his shoulder to take the center, Camille will not able to use the press. King's move doesn't work to stop Camille's press. Tobias can use other technique to win the match.